Welcome to the Best Adirondack Chair Company and congratulations on your purchase. You've either purchased the classic Adirondack chair, the Royal Adirondack chair, or the Grand Adirondack chair. And today, we're going to show you how to assemble those chairs. Step one, you will need a clean surface to assemble your chairs. Carefully open your box and remove your chair parts. You will have eight partially assembled pieces. One assembled back, one assembled seat, two arms, two legs, one front piece, two sticky back washers, and a hardware package. And in your hardware package, you will find four bolts, two large screws, eight smaller screws, four locking nuts, two small washers, two large washers, and 12 medium washers. Before unpacking your chair, please note that you will need a 7 16 and a 1 half inch socket and a square or star screwdriver. This hardware is not included in your package. Step two, assembly of your chair. Carefully take the leg of the chair with the curved side pointing outwards and match A to A and B to B. Next step, take one of the four bolts and a medium washer. Take the hex key, insert the bolt into the middle hole at the leg and screw in place. Once the bolt is sticking out, take the sticky washer and remove the backing. Press firmly on the leg. Once it's firmly placed, screw the bolt tightly into place. Please repeat process on the other leg. Please note, do not use a hammer to push the bolt through. Next step, turn your chair over. Take a rag and clean your bolt on both sides. Once cleaned, take a medium washer and place the medium washer on each bolt. Take your nut and any household oil and place a drop of oil on your nut. Then take the nut and place on the bolt by using the half inch socket and the hex wrench then tighten snugly. Next step, take the unit and flip it over. Lift the legs and make sure they are level. Once that is done, take the front plate and screw into place with the eight smaller screws. Now we're going to assemble the arms. Take one of the four bolts and a medium washer. Take your key wrench, place inside the bolt and screw into place. Now take your large washer and place on the end of the bolt and continue screwing the bolt into place. Do not tighten the bolt just yet. Now repeat the process on the other leg. Now we're going to take one of the arms and we're gonna place A with the A side of the chair and B with the B side of the chair and press firmly. Keep in mind to place the arm onto the bolt you may need to use the key wrench to tighten into place. The next step is to clean your bolt with a rag. Then take a medium washer and place on the bolt. Once the medium washer is on the bolt, then take a nut and repeat the process with your oil in order to lubricate the nut and place it onto the bolt. Once it's placed onto the bolt, you take your key wrench and your one half inch socket and you screw into place until it's snugly. Once it's tightened, raise the arm and level it up. Step three, assembly of the back. Take your back and lock into place. For the final assembly of the chair, you're going to need to change the socket from one half inch to seven sixteenth. Once that is done, take the last large screw and the small washer. Screw into place, but be sure that the two medium washers are set in between the arm and in between the back. Once that is done, you keep on screwing until it's tight and snugly. Repeat on the other arm. Congratulations, you did it, and you assembled your Adirondack chair. Now you can go out and enjoy it for many years to come. If you have any questions or you would like to check out our products, please visit us at thebestadirondackchair.com.